on the road yet again, joined by all of Team Chud. How you doing, Bones? I'm well rested, actually. Well, good. <laughs> Hi, Rachel. Hi. How you feeling? Tired and well rested. <laughs> huh. We're heading up to Dallas right now. We're gonna go see our fabricator who makes all the chud boxes, chimneys, the magical trivet, and we got some new things that they've been working on, which we're gonna take a little look at. Also, uh, the chud press. Oh, the chud press, yeah. Chud press, yeah. Of course. But today we're gonna do a little uh, peek behind the curtain of chud fabrication. Are you ready? Peekaboo. <laughs> <laughs> and be sure to stick around till the end of the video because we're gonna be talking all about our Black Friday slash Cyber Monday sale website wide. <laughs> <laughs> Mandatory stop. Gotta get some beef jerky. Oh yeah. Well, look, smoker, should we get one? <laughs> Cleanest bathrooms in Texas. Gotta love it. On this episode of Bones Tries Things on the Road, beef nuggets. Have you ever had a beaver nugget? I've never had one. All right. I've heard all about them. First try. Okay. Kind of tastes like a Cracker Jack. Tastes like cereal. Right? Yeah. They're good. Good little road snack. Made it to the fab shop. David, how you doing, buddy? Doing great. Doing great. Glad to have you all here. This is a little bit uh, more advanced than most pit building fab shops you're going to see. We got a chud box on the robot. We got to get one of those for the shop. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's a perfect weld. Really quick too. That was a whole side. That was two feet of welding. Oh, now it's going to do the top. Way better than me alone in the garage, folks. I tell you what. Over there. Oh, I love the custom chest. You like it? <laughs> that, a, was, that, that was Zach's idea. That was Zach's idea. What's the total time it takes to make a chud box start to finish? On this second batch, we got them from laser cutting to weld in like a week and a half, and then they'll probably spend a week or two back here getting do, everything welded and then off the paint. And you're doing so batches of? 50 right now, yeah. So probably three and a half weeks in the shop right now. So pretty fast. This thing lives in the weld department. It's just getting everything fitted and proper and fixtured and you probably got seven or eight different weld operations in here. A little sneak peek of something coming up here in a minute. Ooh. <laughs> That's so sweet. Yep. That robot's better than I am. Oh yeah. <laughs> New products coming soon. Oh. New chud table. Looking so good. Rachel, tell us all about it. Shiny. <laughs> this thing is sick. Stainless steel top. Stainless steel top. Aluminum Sky. body. Drawers that hold stuff. <laughs> well, what's awesome about this one is that it is bolt together, so we can flat pack ship it right to your door. Jumps I'm just loving way. the way it looks. It's just so clean. Bones, what else is new? This is the, the old chud grill. It's like a chud box, but it's not. And charcoal access. Yes, How do you do it? Lots of, lots of engineering and thoughtfulness and and giant laser machines. And giant laser machines. <laughs> well, yeah, this is also flat pack shippable. Pull together micro chud box. The old chud <laughs> grill. Prototype. Same cooking area as the chud box. About fourth the weight. And doesn't require a giant truck to get and into your door. And does not require <laughs> lift gate service or, or a pallet. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> Coming soon. I want to cook on it real bad. Yeah. Got a few yeah. tweaks to make, but uh, definitely have to cook a few steaks before we really know if it works. Mm. Or, no. or some mackerel. Macro. <laughs> Laser machines, press brakes. This place is definitely more advanced than any welding shop I'm gonna ever have. Rachel, what do you think? Should we roll a montage of a bunch of sweet welding footage from this place? Yes. Coming up!
freeway. Looking good. This is where they all get packaged up and shipped out. We're doing a sale on painted chud boxes. Oh, we're doing a Black Friday sale, aren't we? Oh, yeah. More on that in a minute. Some of these are going across the pond to England, too. Bunch of chud presses up in here. Those are legs for the chud boxes. All these are full of chud presses, though. Did it fit? Oh, that definitely fits. That definitely fits. <laughs> Look at oh, that. Yeah, That's I a like camping love, grill. Baby. Quick little pit stop on the way home. Shout out! A Pittman stop? No! Oh! <laughs> Made it home with a new Chud grill. This is the prototyping process. I'm gonna run this thing through its paces. And right off the bat, there's a few things I definitely want to change, but this is basically the process for how we make our stuff. I draw it badly on a whiteboard. Bones draws it up in CAD. Then we talk to the engineers up at the fabrication shop, get a prototype knocked out, test it out, change a few things, and when we're happy with it, we'll bring it to production. But more on this grill in a few months. All right, y'all, just in time for the holidays, we've got ourselves another little merch item here. And uh, check this out. These are some leather little keychains made by the same guy who makes our aprons. But what's interesting about these is when we got them, they're made out of just raw leather like this. So I needed to tan it myself, which is kind of cool. So what I did is I took it and I dipped it in some beef tallow, which made it look like that. And then I popped them on the pit here, right next to a brisket. This is what they look like after they've cooked for about an hour. And I think they look pretty sweet. So if you want to get yourself a smoked on my own pit next to a brisket little keychain, head over to the website. We got a bunch of them. And most of these came out really good. A couple of them are darker than others. So each one is unique. And a few of them I just burned the hell out of. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, I don't think we'll be selling the crispy ones. But let me know down below. Is this just pure gimmick? Does it make sense? It smells smoky. All right, y'all, we have made it back to the Chud Shop after our little day trip up to Dallas. I hope you enjoyed that little behind the scenes of how all the Chud stuff is made. But yeah, I hope you have a better understanding of how everything is made and uh, the fact that it's not in the garage anymore. And that's for good reason. I'm sure once you've seen that facility with all of their fancy tools, you can understand that it's a little bit better in every way than what I was building in the garage. You're not good at helping. Yeah, no. <laughs> They'll see this build in a minute. Yeah, probably next week, a couple weeks. But yeah, that was a nightmare. Also, you can now probably understand why we have to price things the way we do because there's a whole team working there. We work really closely with their engineering team and their fabricators and all the prototyping we do. That's why we went up there to check on the grill and the table and whatnot. But it's a process to get things built and perfected like the chud box and the chimney, which we're done with at this point. There's no tweaks I'm ever going to make on those. Maybe. Mini chud box isn't changing anyway, but... Looking at this guy, this is the full size. This is the new one for Leroy and Lewis. And uh, I kind of want to build some more of those. Yeah. Because with, yeah, with them behind us, we could make that thing so much better. So let me know in the comments if you would be interested in that because we'd probably just do a limited run because that'd be a lot harder to ship, but it could be cool. But as I alluded to earlier in this video, today is Thanksgiving if you're watching this in real time, which means tomorrow is Black Friday leading up to Cyber Monday. So we got to talk about the sale. Bones, Black Friday sale. What are the details? Uh, absolutely everything is on sale. Site-wide? Site-wide, everything. Including pits? Yeah, including the pits. What's the deal with the chud box? Uh, so the chud box, it's gonna come with a side table and a grill basket and a $100 gift card. So $2,000, you get all of those things, which is great. Rubs on sale, all the the clothing's on sale, everything. We got some new stuff in too. Why don't you grab one of those uh, long sleeves? Oh, yeah. Show the fine people. Our good buddy Eli Wood made us another shirt that is sick i told you to call this the bones shirt yeah but you didn't do too it on the nose yeah all right. <laughs> he's the same guy who did the uh sexy muscle brad fighting a snake tattoo artist buddy up in uh, vermont but that's that's nice also great time of year for a long sleeve yeah finally we released something at the right time <laughs> yeah unlike this crew neck which is very minimalist have you guys seen the crew neck because that came out in like july yeah but i wear it all the time i love this because it's so subtle just a little boot snake on there. Yeah. Nothing else. Yeah. Went on a date yesterday and she was like, what is that? <laughs> I was like, that's, it's Chuds. It's us. Other than that, we've still got all the classic shirts, the clean weenie shirt. We've got the baseball tee, which is now on the website. The uh, snake in the boot pocket tee. All the koozies. Got these hats. It's finally beanie weather again. Stickers, we've got three bandanas. These are all the rotisseries. Of course, got the big stupid hat. Fresh stock up of knife rolls and aprons. We are ready. Yeah. Last year, we weren't ready. <laughs> no, we sold out <laughs> so fast. <laughs> Not this year. We also got all these keychains. These are looking cool. And uh, it's been a few days since I smoked these and they still smell like brisket. It smells good. I'm, I've got one right now. Oh, nice. It literally smells like Texas barbecue. It's amazing. Yeah, we thought it would just be smoky, but it actually smells like brisket and it's lingering which is cool so 
We only have like 80 of those, so... Those act, are going to go fast. Yeah, act, act quick on those. Luckily, we can make those pretty quick. Just got to smoke a burger. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't be surprised if someone tried to eat it. It don't eat it. Yeah. And if anyone cares, those were smoked next to a Wagyu brisket, so <laughs> only the best. I don't think anyone cares. Nope. <laughs> but everything else, we have the fire starters, the pepper, the sausage mix, and all of our rubs. Get the snake bite. It's my favorite rub. It's really good on chicken thighs, chicken wings. So good. <laughs> Uck. What's happening in the UK, bud? Uh, so if you are in the UK and you want some Chud's products, go to Pro Smoke Barbecue. Uh, they're doing pre-sales on Chud boxes, Chud presses, Chud chimneys, hats, rub, mix. We still got some Chud tables available. They're not here. They're in the other room over there. But we've got like 10 or 15 of those. I think we have 11 left. Four of them are painted. Comes with the custom uh, chuddy booze block on there. So we are dropping the price on those too. We're trying to get rid of them. So what are we, what are we, at? what are we, <laughs> what are we, what are we doing? Bud? They are $400 off. But uh, yeah, those are probably gonna be the last chud tables ever in full welded steel form. So get yours now. Can we ship those? We're gonna figure out how to create chips so we can reduce the price because we tried to not create them and they got all bent up. So we're gonna figure it out. Nice. But local pickup is better. Way better. And we can hang out and have a Miller Lite. Speaking of which. Yeah. Nice. Clinkies. And if you didn't think that keychains were the most boring thing we could add to the website. <laughs> <laughs> new merch alert. <sighs> nice tote, Imagine bud. going to the grocery store with this. <laughs> I've done it twice already. Oh, wow. It is kind of awkward carrying your own brand around, but. For everyone else, it's cool. I think it's less awkward than you wearing your face. I do just get it trimmed up. <laughs> I meant the shirt. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's on sale too, right? Yep, it's, uh, that one's 40 bucks off. Before we end this shameless plug here, <laughs> is there anything we missed? Free shipping on all orders over $100. Ooh. Not including freight. Oh. Or international. I was gonna say that'd be like a couple thousand dollars <laughs> off. <laughs> Free shipping. How long is the sale running for? Friday through Monday. So it'll end at midnight on Monday. Couple days, move quick, folks. Keep this guy busy. Oh, yeah. You're Santa, I'm the elf. I don't know what Rachel is. But I think that's gonna do it for this little vid here. I hope you enjoyed seeing a little behind the scenes on how things are made and how things kind of operate around here. And uh, be sure to head on to the website, chudsbarbecue.com or shopchuds.com, they both work. But uh, yeah, we're all geared up. We got a whole bunch more rubs and stuff coming in, so we are fully stocked. And as always, I appreciate you supporting your local Chuds Barbecue. Your local Chuds Barbecue. I mean, I'm local. <laughs> <laughs> and be sure to stay tuned for more updates on the new table and the new grill that should be coming out in the next few months got to do some redesigns on it after testing it out but more on that in a future video and as always happy thanksgiving happy holidays and i will see you on tuesday peace